Okay, this was sent to me by Orico, and uh, this is the M.2 512 gigs, the SSD drive that you can use in internally or portable externally that we're gonna try both of them this model is the y-20m and uh we'll just crack it open and uh, see what's uh, going on inside and yes this is a 3d nand flash and let me pull out everything that's inside here we have the drive itself the little screw here that's good and a user's manual that you can go through if you want to read more about it and it teaches you how to use it and all that good stuff well let me just open this one up and here's the drive itself 512 gigs yep it is really beautiful one-sided chip that means the flash and all that are on this side the paper is almost like a color shifting on top of it i don't know if the camera is showing it good it's really cool actually uh, m.2 b key and m key 500 megabits per megabytes per second is the speed advertised here for reading flash type 3d nand flash size 2280 temperatures of course minus 40 celsius up to 85 celsius and environmental temperatures or working temperatures zero celsius up to 70 celsius and besides that this is all about it let's go uh throw it in the cooker and see what we're doing here okay so we have it connected here now and uh of course i just formatted it real quick always it's a great practice to format any kind of usb drive or hard drive or m.2 or whatever you have to format it first so properties and we have 476 gigabytes in it out of 512 that's advertised which is normal for every uh, system. That's just how it works. And really quick, I'm going to throw in just an oak tree cutting folder. That's 1.7 gigabytes. And the speeds are really good because they advertise up to 500 megabytes per second read. And this was right. So this is right up uh, to par with what they advertise. And as you see, 1.79 gigabytes almost 2 gigabytes now i'm gonna take this uh, same folder out of here and throw it on the desktop and boom well that was uh that was too fast it, i didn't even have time to see it so that uh, that works i i don't i don't even expect any problems with that part but let's go to black magic disk speeds and uh select this drive and see what we're uh dealing with here it should be right around the 500 advertised speeds which if you are over 390 usually you're good i trust me i've dealt with a lot of drives and <laughs> but so far orico i have zero complaints about them because they actually do the job really good yep 437 we are really good 511 read even higher than they actually advertise by 11 megabytes so yeah, that's uh, that's right where it would be expected from Orico. I really love what they do, and this one does not disappoint at all. Really quick, I'm going to plug it inside my PC, so it will be directly on the motherboard. And we'll do some speed tests directly from the motherboard itself. Why only external? Okay, let's stop this one here. So we know so far it's actually doing absolutely amazing. And yes, just to check it again. Yep, this is the same one. Use space 2.8 gigabytes is just the files that are generated from Blackmagic. So after this, I'm going to uh, format it. And uh, I'm going to plug it inside the PC and see what it does. Speeds should be the same, if not better. But of course, it, it's not going to get better than over 500 that they advertise. So yeah, so far, I'm surprised that actually it went 511. That's just a little bit over 500 that they advertise. So let me plug it back inside this uh, computer and uh, we'll be right back. Okay, so the drive is now plugged in directly to the motherboard. Uh, let me see if I can actually zoom in. Yep, right there. The new Oracle we just got. And uh, we're gonna go ahead and test some of the speeds really quick. And uh, yeah, this is an old GTX card but it works and uh, just disregard the dust that's all i can ask <laughs> so let's get some speeds going and see what's happening okay so here we are now the orico has been installed inside on the motherboard directly 
And uh, we're going to do the oak tree cutting folder again. Whoa, this went a little bit too fast now. Uh, let me delete it really quick and try it again. Whoa, okay, that was a little bit too fast. I don't know what happened there. And yes, we are inside the uh, same Orico as before right here. Let me do a quick format. Maybe there is residual files that were there. Click OK. Boom, format complete. Let me get the folder again. OK, and now try the oak tree. Yeah, it's actually. <laughs> so it's it's a little bit faster. Of course, inside the motherboard, that's directly. So makes sense. Taking it out. Boom. Whoa. Did it just say 3.8 gigabit per second there? Hold on, hold on, hold on. This, uh, I don't know what I'm doing at this point. Let me empty this bin here again. This file does not exist in our computer here. So let me drop it again. Yeah, literally no timing. I did not cut this part of the video at all. So this is interesting. It just got even faster somehow inside the uh, motherboard. I mean, it makes sense, obviously, but just huh that's uh that's something orico overdid themselves again i love that they always do something that blows my mind somehow they find a way so uh let's uh fire up black magic design and uh hit speed test and speed test just like before 420 to right speeds and right around 500 almost read so how is that even possible that folder that's uh that's very interesting yeah over 500 just like before even though it's inside on the motherboard itself somehow it just works faster okay so let me stop this one here delete this file let me try a different file because maybe i'm missing something here and uh there's a camdoc video that i just made and i'm gonna transfer yeah literally took zero seconds so yeah 600 megabytes video wow this is this is something let me delete this again let me put this entire folder let me see how big this folder is okay so the whole folder is uh five and a half gigabytes let me try the whole folder because that will give us more time yeah wait how is that even possible now it drops to the advertised speeds but it starts at two gigabytes orico did something good here I i'm not gonna complain i mean having it higher i will not complain but this is something that's mind-blowing a little bit that's really fast and uh yeah as you saw yourself i don't really need to tell you anything besides what i showed here that actually it is fast it's really fast and when I'm transferring files, some hype manages to get even faster. So, yeah. And with that said, I'll leave a link down uh, on the description. And if you buy through that link, I make a small, tiny commission at no extra cost to you. And with that said, please like and subscribe and share it with someone that you might think wants to see it for giggles, I guess. I don't know. We'll see you next time. Bye.